the Sulu Sea, a name that conjures images of turquoise waters, coral reefs teeming with life, and islands fringed with pristine beaches. But beneath this idyllic surface lies a hidden treasure, vast reserves of oil and gas. This potential wealth has sparked international interest, turning the Sulu Sea into a focal point for energy exploration. For centuries, the Sulu Sea has been a vital waterway for trade and cultural exchange. Now, it stands on the brink of a new era, one where its energy resources could fuel economic growth and transform lives. But this potential comes at a price. The quest for oil and gas in the Sulu Sea raises critical questions about environmental protection, sustainability, and the delicate balance between progress and preservation. As we delve into the depths of this complex issue, we must consider the potential benefits alongside the risks. The future of the Sulu Sea, its people, and its fragile ecosystem hangs in the balance. It's a story of high stakes, technological marvels, and the enduring power of nature. To understand the presence of oil and gas in the Sulu Sea, we must journey millions of years back in time. Imagine a world where dinosaurs roamed and the continents were still forming. The Sulu Sea, as we know it today, didn't exist. Instead, this region was a vast basin, slowly sinking under the weight of accumulating sediments. Over eons, layers upon layers of organic matter, primarily the remains of ancient marine life, settled on the seabed. This organic material, subjected to intense heat and pressure deep underground, underwent a remarkable transformation. It became the oil and gas that we seek today. These hydrocarbons, lighter than water, gradually migrated upwards through porous rock formations. They became trapped beneath impermeable layers, forming vast reservoirs. These geological formations, hidden beneath the seabed, hold the key to the Sulu Sea's energy potential. Understanding the geological history of the Sulu Sea is crucial for locating and extracting these valuable resources. It's a story written in rock, a testament to the immense power of time and the Earth's transformative processes. The story of oil and gas exploration in the Sulu Sea is one shrouded in mystery and intrigue. Early attempts to unlock the region's energy potential are often lost to time, hidden in fragmented records and whispered rumors. Some tales speak of ancient mariners, noticing oil slicks on the water's surface, hinting at the treasures below. However, it wasn't until the early 20th century that organized exploration efforts truly began. Driven by growing global demand for energy, pioneering companies ventured into the Sulu Sea, armed with rudimentary equipment and a thirst for discovery. These early explorers faced numerous challenges, harsh weather conditions, logistical nightmares, and the constant threat of piracy in these remote waters. Despite these obstacles, their efforts laid the groundwork for future exploration, providing the first glimpses into the Sulu Sea's energy potential. Their stories, though fragmented, serve as a reminder of the human spirit of adventure and the relentless pursuit of valuable resources. As the 20th century progressed, the race for oil and gas in the Sulu Sea intensified. Governments, eager to secure energy independence and economic prosperity, began to take notice. They granted exploration licenses to both national and international oil companies, sparking a flurry of activity in the region. Corporations, armed with advanced technology and driven by the promise of vast profits, poured resources into seismic surveys, exploratory drilling, and infrastructure development. The Sulu Sea became a hotbed of activity, with drilling platforms dotting the horizon and supply ships crisscrossing its waters. This influx of investment and expertise led to significant discoveries, confirming the existence of substantial oil and gas reserves. The Sulu Sea, once a place of mystery, was now firmly on the map as a potential energy powerhouse. However, this scramble for resources also sparked tensions. Disputes over territorial claims and maritime boundaries arose, adding another layer of complexity to the already challenging task of oil and gas exploration. Milestones in Sulu Sea Exploration The history of oil and gas exploration in the Sulu Sea is marked by key discoveries. In 1912, the first recorded oil well is drilled off Borneo. Seismic surveys in the 70s reveal significant sedimentary basins. The first commercial oil discovery in the 80s sparks further interest. 
90s advancements in seismic imaging lead to new prospects. The 2000s see several gas discoveries. In the 2010s, deep water exploration gains momentum. This timeline shows the evolution of exploration in the Sulu Sea. Black gold or environmental disaster? Weighing the pros and cons. The discovery of oil and gas in the Sulu Sea is a double-edged sword. It promises economic growth and improved livelihoods, but it risks environmental damage and social disruption. Oil revenues could fuel development, funding infrastructure projects, education, and healthcare. Yet, exploration carries environmental risks. Oil spills could devastate marine ecosystems. Fossil fuels contribute to climate change. This poses severe risks to the Sulu Sea. Section 7, A Sea at Risk, Environmental Concerns and Conservation Efforts. The Sulu Sea is not just an energy resource. It's a vibrant ecosystem teeming with life. Its coral reefs, among the most diverse in the world, support a dazzling array of marine species. Coastal communities rely on its bounty for their livelihoods, while its natural beauty attracts tourists from around the globe. Oil and gas exploration and production pose significant threats to this fragile environment. The risk of oil spills looms large, with the potential to cause catastrophic damage to marine life, coastal habitats, and the livelihoods of those who depend on them. Seismic surveys, using loud sound waves to map the seabed, can disrupt marine mammal communication and migration patterns. The construction of pipelines and other infrastructure can damage sensitive habitats, fragmenting ecosystems and disrupting ecological processes. The discharge of drilling fluids and wastewater can contaminate water quality, affecting marine organisms and potentially human health. Recognizing these risks, governments and conservation organizations are working to mitigate the environmental impacts of oil and gas activities. Marine protected areas are being established to safeguard critical habitats. Stricter environmental regulations are being implemented to minimize pollution and promote responsible operations. Section 8. The Renewable Energy Horizon, A Brighter Future for the Sulu Sea? As the world grapples with the urgency of climate change, the Sulu Sea stands at an energy crossroads. While oil and gas reserves offer short-term economic gains, they come with long-term environmental consequences. This reality has sparked growing interest in renewable energy sources as a more sustainable path for the region. The Sulu Sea, blessed with abundant sunshine and strong winds, holds immense potential for renewable energy development. Solar farms, strategically placed on less ecologically sensitive islands, could harness the sun's power to generate clean electricity. Offshore wind farms, capitalizing on the region's consistent winds, could transform the Sulu Sea into a hub for wind energy production. These renewable energy sources offer a pathway to economic growth without the environmental burdens of fossil fuels. Investing in renewable energy would create new jobs, reduce carbon emissions, and promote energy independence. It would also protect the Sulu Sea's natural beauty and preserve its rich biodiversity for generations to come. Section 9. The Energy Crossroads, Charting a Sustainable Course for the Sulu Sea. The Sulu Sea stands at a critical juncture. The allure of oil and gas wealth is undeniable, offering the potential to transform economies and improve lives. However, the environmental costs associated with this path are equally significant, threatening the very ecosystem that sustains the region. The challenge lies in finding a balance. Can we harness the energy potential of the Sulu Sea while safeguarding its natural heritage? Can we pursue economic development without jeopardizing the health of the environment and the well-being of future generations? The answer lies in embracing a sustainable approach to energy development, one that prioritizes renewable energy sources, minimizes environmental impacts, and fosters regional cooperation. It requires a shift in mindset, from short-term gains to long-term sustainability. The future of the Sulu Sea hinges on the choices we make today. By choosing a path of environmental responsibility, technological innovation, and regional collaboration, we can unlock the true potential of this precious resource, ensuring a brighter future for the Sulu Sea and its people. Hello, amazing viewers. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you. We're only 200 subscribers away from a huge goal, and I'd be thrilled if you'd join our growing community. 
Your support fuels my passion, and I promise to keep creating content you'll love. Kabayan Magpapahuli Batayodito, thank you from the bottom of my heart.